everyone, this is I Home Bake again. Today I am going to show you how to make sticker rice with mango. Now in Asian restaurant, sticker rice and mango is usually one of the popular dessert, most especially when you are going to Thai restaurant. And that is what exactly what I have made you today. So so this is sticker rice and mango with peanuts and sesame. Alright guys, here are the ingredients. Sweet rice. Now I have been soaking this rice for a couple hours and I just drained it. That's why it looks like that. Mango, coconut milk, and along here, this is where I'm going to boil the rice. You can boil the rice or steam the rice. So follow along guys, this is very easy. So the next thing to do, like I told you, I have been soaking this rice for a couple hours so what I'm going to do is steam this I'm going to put everything if you have a steamer you can just use that now for me I'm not cooking that much first first you put the water here right all right so just like that and I'm going to cover this Just like that. All right, guys. So another method. All right, guys. So while I'm waiting for the rice, okay. So maybe this is about 15 more minutes. It's ready. So along here, I'm going to go ahead and cook the coconut milk. cup of sugar and then one fourth salt mix now this sauce is the one that we are going to cook the rice with once this thing is boiled I'm going to transfer the rice here, mix it together and let it cool. Alright guys, so the next thing I'm going to do, because the coconut milk has already been boiling, what I'm going to do is switch. Alright, so... Put enough coconut milk that will cover the rice. Adding the sweet rice. mixing the coconut milk and the rice together. That's beautiful. Okay, so what I'm going to do now is to cover for about 20 minutes. So while I'm waiting for the rice, I'm going to go ahead and cut this mango. Get a spoon and scoop the mango out. So scooping the mango because I need the mango skin. Not beautiful. Now I'm going to uh, make this a design. is also leave over from the coconut milk that I made earlier. What I'm gonna do here is adding 
one teaspoon of cornstarch and mix this well this is already mixed with sugar and a little bit of salt okay now it is getting thick and creamier turn off the heat so you only have to cook this for about one minute constantly stirring your coconut milk all right this is the consistency that you are looking for this has been sitting for actually 45 minutes because i said earlier 20 minutes but when i checked it needed a little bit more time this is what it looked like so now it is nice and cool I'm going to transfer this in here so what I'm gonna do is just get a scoop of sweet rice Okay, so what I'm doing is cutting a little bit of pieces of mango. I am going to use this to decorate these little pieces. Alright, I'm going to set this aside. Wrestling with sesame. What I'm doing here, I am going to make this peanut. So I'm gonna grind this. Adding the peanut, the ground peanut. So you can put peanut or yellow bean whatever that you desire you can even put like hazelnut add your coconut sauce A bit more rice on top just like that I mean you can pretty much play with your own food just make it nice and pretty sesame black and brown sesame put a little bit of sauce pretty I mean check this out so I use the mango and that's it all right so let's have a taste let's have a taste and give you the review mm. nice and creamy not too sweet with the sesame and the mango wow excellent 
it is divine. Now I'm going to try the peanuts. So you can use peanuts or yellow mung bean or hazelnut, you know, be creative. Wow, that's good too with the peanuts. Crunchy. Chewy. But good. Okay. Now with this one, I don't think I'm going to eat it. It's just a beautiful, cute design. Now of course, mango and sticky rice. So let's get a piece of mango and the rice along with the coconut sauce. guys so um that is it i already give you the review it is amazing so until next time peace out